my tanning in. in. I make videos to show you how to win. How to win. Always peace and peace with Hector and Rim. I prove this formula the best you've ever seen. Ever seen. Subscribe to the channel. Videos daily. Subscribe to the channel. Join Team Team and subscribe to the channel. If you're new, hit subscribe on the channel. Ching! Before I continue with this video, I just want to say thank you to each and every one of you who've hit that subscribe button. We've recently hit 6k, I literally hit 5k last week. The support has been amazing. Also, quick thanks to Momo as well. I made a video of him and I know a lot of you came from his channel. So Team T-Mac is becoming stronger every single day. Also, I just wanted to say for those of you who watch my videos who have Twitter, if you follow me and send me a tweet with hashtag Team T-Mac, I will be following everyone back. Once again, thanks for the amazing support and the videos. I'm trying to take into consideration what you guys tell me in the comments. I reply to every single one of my comments. So if you have anything to say or to ask me, let me know. And with that said, let's get on to today's squad builder. Hey guys, see Max heading in, and today I'm going to be bringing you a 25 to 30k Italian squad builder. Now this was actually suggested by one of you guys in the comments. So I went to work built a squad, tried it out and used a variation of players till I ended up with the squad I'm going to be showing you guys today. I'm using the 4-3-1-2 formation, it's another narrow formation, it's actually really fun to use and with this team I'm going to show you it works really well. Starting us off we have Perrin, now another one of you guys actually commented a while back for me to try this guy out and I did and he's freaking OP. Only cost me 1,200 coins. He's six foot two. He's got 90 reflexes, like 90 reflexes. That's just insane. 57 speed, which is actually quite fast for a keeper, and 78 positioning. He's got decent stats. His worst stats probably kicking, but that's not too much of a big issue. And apart from that, he's just a really good keeper to use. Now, as my two centre backs, I've gone for Barzagli as well as Benucci. Now, these are probably the two most expensive players in this team. Starting us off with Benucci, cost me 7.7k coins. I've used him before and since the last time I actually used him he's gone down in price He's 6 foot 3 as you can see there He's got decent work rates, medium high which is always good And he's got 70 pace as well as 81 physical and 85 defending In this game if a defender doesn't have pace that's lower than 70 Then they're not that bad Especially with this guy In game he's a freaking beast And beside him we have Barzagli Cost me 12.7k coins That was the lowest I could buy him It's insane mainly because he's 6 foot 1 He's got the best possible work rate and defender could have low to high is 75 pace 88 defending and 77 physical which isn't too bad as well these two players are both bricks in defense and i'm really enjoying using them in this team fullbacks we have a batte on one side and the skiggly on the other side now the skiggly is actually my 10k op squad builder he's the beast so as i was making an italian team i thought why not use him again only cost me 400 coins but look at his stats guys 84 pace 75 defending 76 physical he's also 6 for as well and all that for 400 coins he's just an insane player and on the other side we have a batte cost me 2.6k coins mainly use this guy because he's really fast as you can see they're 92 pace but he also has other decent stats such as his 80 physical and 75 defending on to my central midfielders i went with benaventura parolo is another guy i used in my op 10k squad and not torino once again another player from that squad this midfield is actually quite op starting us off with parolo as you can see six foot one 74 pace 82 physical and 77 defending he has all that and he only cost me 1.1k coins he plays insane and he's actually cool to use in game next thing with Nacherino non rare gold as you can see there he doesn't look like he's the best of cards but when you look closely at his stats here 75 pace 75 dribbling 80 physical 72 shooting he doesn't have a stat that's lower than 70 that's why this guy is so good I don't know why he's not a rare player but he should be and for only 400 coins you should definitely buy him and here is our last central midfielder we have Bonaventura freaking insane name right there 80 pace 81 dribbling 76 shooting as well as 78 passing he's got some decent stats on him it was quite cheap so I thought I'd throw him in the team he plays well and up to now he hasn't really done me wrong before using him I actually had Pirlo in that position as you can see there he's on my bench Pirlo is another decent player you can put in that position but he cost me 2.1k coins so he was slightly more expensive he's not the fastest of players but he's got great passing so if you're a person who likes dribbling through and passing and creating
creating chances like that. You can put Pirlo there instead of Bonaventura. The only difference is the price of the squad will slightly rise. But if what you're looking for is passing, then Pirlo would probably be a better option there. Up top is my attacking player. Starting off with a cam we have Insigne. This dude is a beast as you can see there. Only cost me 1.2k coins. Four goals in three games. This guy is an absolute beast. He's got 89 pace, 87 dribbling. The only thing about him that isn't the best is the fact that he's 5 foot 4. But if you can get him through and through balls, dribble with him, you'll be alright. First striker, we have Giovinco. I actually converted him from a centre forward. You could probably buy him for cheap as a striker anyway. 90 pace, 85 dribbling, 4 star skills, 4 star weak foot. He only cost me 1.8k coins. So he wasn't the most expensive. And the only downside about this guy is the fact that he's 5 foot 5 but if you can get him in on a through ball he can actually get through I've used him for three games he's not scored somehow it's actually annoying how he's not scored yet because he's got so many chances but hopefully when I jump into the game for you guys he will score and my last striker there is Sal now this dude is no longer in the Serie A he's in the Serie B so this is the perfect team you can use him in if you want to try him out he has 94 pace 83 dribbling which is insane by itself 74 shooting which for a 75 rated card is beast he only cost me 650 coins i mean i don't know where you can go wrong with actually buying this guy four star weak foot which isn't the worst he's got high medium work rates which are always good for a striker and he's got three goals in three games for me and i know you guys are probably gonna be like yeah i like to use pay sweaty players i know i do but i did also try out rossi up top and I'm not going to lie guys, he didn't actually play that well, so I didn't end up putting him in the squad. I mean, if you want to try him out for yourself, give him a go. And I mean, if he does do well for you, you can also let me know in the comment section. Nevertheless, this is the full team as you can see. Once again, it will cost you 25 to 30k coins. So far, I've played three games with this team in the Monster Ball Cup. I've won all of these games, so I'm in the final. The gameplay you're going to be seeing for me is going to be me in the final. And just to prove it to you guys, here we go. We're about to go into the final with this Italian team it's won every game up to now let's play this and hopefully we can take a win it was just banter let's watch this guy carefully okay starting off on a through ball ready come on come on ah damn Sal use that 94 pace I know you have Come on, oh look at that, Sal powering off Bazagli. Sal, come on, oh, please, no, how did his keeper save that? Did you all freaking see that? How? Eat this, boom, fake, finesse, oh, damn, tried to freaking trick him, didn't work. Run, just through ball it, Jovinko, through ball it. Come on, Sal, run, my thumb is not on the thing right. Sal, Sal, oh, damn, he couldn't shoot fast enough, but he's getting through. Sal to cross it in, shouldn't really be crossing in, I got short players. Oh, I saved that, and we score a header. Oh my freaking days, I'm talking about how short my players are, and I think that's not Torino who scored a header. A 400 coin player scoring the first goal for us, like, what even is this? Oh, Bamiyang is freaking pacey. I'm not. I can't be letting him score straight after. There we go. I can take the free kick every freaking day of the week. There. I'm not letting a Bamiyang through like that. Oh snap! Boom! Look at that defending. Jesus Christ! Where did he even come from? No. Oh my God! Ah, the ball freaking rebounded. It literally went to his player. He got lucky there. Jovinko, Jovinko, come on. Jovinko shoot! Oh! Wow! That was an insane shot! Oh, find that pass. Okay, who's running through for him? No one's making- Oh, there we go, we see the run. We see the run, Insigne! Oh my days! I thought that was a guaranteed goal! Simple pass. Okay. It's work, turn. Oh, finesse! Wait! Oh my freaking days! Sal is a freaking beast. He's on his second goal already. If you've not tried him out in this game, definitely give him a try. Alright. Not Torino. We're looking. Oh, I see the run. Insigne. Get their touch. Finesse. Across the keeper. You're not saving it. You're just not saving it. Like, this team is too good. Insigne is a beast. 3-1. And it's not even half time yet. Come on. Don't let him run through. Oh, Insigne has just outpowered someone. What? What? 
Is that it? How does that even happen? I think he outpowered Narata. No. What? What a freaking stop by the keeper. And it didn't go out for a corner. I'm just loving using this team at the moment. It's half time, boys. As you can see, he's got slightly more possession. I've got more shots on target and I'm winning 3 1. This team literally costs 25 to 30k coins. And I'm in the final and I'm winning 3 1. Let's jump into the second half and finish off this game. The support is there. Insigne. Insigne. Oh my freaking days. Oh my days. His dribbling is so good. Okay, watch these runs. Boom! Not today. Abate watched it. Watch these runs. We're blocking. There we go. That's the kind of defending you like to see. You need to be careful here. Not today. He's going to give him a red card. That's going to be a red card, isn't it? Oh! Oh no! He had a yellow from before. Ah! Oh. Right, so Benucci sent off. With three one up, I'm gonna have to play tactically, guys. Now I need to make some sort of change here, otherwise he will end up winning the game. So I've made a change. I've had to bring on a random player off the bench to make up my defense again. Otherwise, the chances are I probably would have lost because this guy's got too many pacey players. Run! This is Sal. Okay, Sal, come on, come on, Sal, come on, Sal. Oh it's four one. He. I actually don't know what to say about this guy. He just does what he wants. He's pacey, good dribbling, gets through, score. He only cost me 650 coins. Say what? He's definitely a hidden gem or a cheap beast or something along those lines. There we go, not to re -knock. Now! Okay. Insignia, oh, referee. Come on, that should be like a red card or something. I was way through and he just took me down. There we go. Yeah, that's fair. Ten man on each side because that tackle from him was just dirty. Okay, Insigne. Now. Oh, not Chirino. Takes his time. Ah, damn. Damn, I should have finessed it. But that's the end of the game, guys. I mean, with 1-4-1 one, one with this team, I'm actually impressed with how they've played. And as you can see there, I am the winner of the Monsters World Cup. 7,500 coins in the bag. If this doesn't convince you to try out this team, then I don't know what will. Because I managed to play through a tournament and win, which shows just how good it is. Man of the match in that game was in fact one of the cheapest players on the team. Nocturino with a 9.5 rating. Goals came from Sal with 2 Insigne with 1 and Nocturino got 1 as well. Possibly could have scored more. This is the team once again as you can see there. Unfortunately Benucci got a red card but the team played well. If you think you're probably going to try out this team let me know down in the comment section because I want to see how many of you guys actually give this team a go. Once again it only costs you 25 to 30k coins so it's ridiculously cheap. And yet drop a like if you enjoyed this video as I'll be very much appreciate it that's about it from me this is t-max signing out thanks for watching guys and see ya <laughs> this is the end of the video hard if you enjoy just comment and subscribe want to see more don't forget to leave a like do it <laughs> this is t-max signing out